Hello, cosmic adventurers, ready for a journey that transcends existence as we know it. Today, we're going to explore the catastrophic end of the universe, the fate of stars and black holes, and the absolute void that awaits us at the end of time. Hold on, it's going to be quite a trip. Now imagine with me, we are accelerating the speed of time and traveling into the future, about five billion to several trillion years in the future, far beyond where our civilization has ever dared to go. Our familiar incandescent spheres of energy, the stars, are beginning to show signs of aging. After burning relentlessly for billions of years, fueled by the power of nuclear fusion, stars begin to consume their fuel. What we can call a cosmic energy crisis takes place. Be it our sun or the farthest stars, they all face the same fate. Those with enough mass explode in spectacular supernovae. The biggest of them collapse under their own weight to form black holes, the star-devouring monsters. And smaller stars, like our own sun, end their lives more peacefully. They swell to become red giants before shedding their outer layers and leaving behind a hot, dense core known as a white dwarf. So in the vastness of time, a sky once filled with twinkling stars becomes a field of dead giants, white dwarfs, and black holes. We've advanced trillions of years into our journey, and the universe as we know it is unrecognizable. Let's go now to a further, much further epoch, about one quadrillion to the ten to the hundred years in the future. We fast forward from trillions to quadrillions of years into the future. In this phase, we are transported to a cosmic period dominated by monsters of almost infinite density, black holes. On a space tour like this, you'd expect to see twinkling stars, wouldn't you? But not. Here in the far future, the stars are legends of the past. All remaining white dwarfs, neutron stars, and other celestial bodies have been sucked in or ejected from our galaxy, leaving behind silent but incredibly powerful black holes. We are now traveling into a future so remote that even the word time is beginning to lose its meaning. We are one Google years away from the birth of the universe, that is, a one followed by a hundred zeros, a number almost beyond comprehension. Even black holes, those giants of the universe are beginning to meet their end. In this era, they are slowly evaporating due to Hawking radiation, a theoretical discovery that predicts that black holes lose energy, and therefore mass, over time. They are the titans of this age swirling silently in the void of space. Activity becomes incredibly rare. As black holes are gradually evaporated by Hawking radiation, the universe becomes increasingly empty and dark. When the last black hole evaporates, the universe enters a new era of eternal silence. This is the era known as heat death, where entropy reaches its maximum and all complex structures dissolve. Where we are now is a place of eternal silence and infinite darkness. This is the era of black holes, and we are moving beyond the inconceivable towards what scientists call the heat death of the universe. As we delve deeper into the future, we move from the Google house of years into the age of the big freeze. We are now a Googleplex of years away from the Big Bang, a one followed by a Google of zeros, an almost inconceivable number. At this stage, every particle in the universe is so far apart that it's as if the universe were a vast, empty cosmic desert. There are no more stars to light up the darkness, and the temperature of the universe is close to absolute zero. The atoms that once made up the stars and planets now break down into subatomic particles, the protons and neutrons. These eventually decay into even smaller particles. Imagine a universe where there is no light, no heat, just scattered subatomic particles wandering in endless darkness. This is the scenario of a universe in its freezing phase. Over an unimaginable amount of time, even these subatomic particles will eventually dwindle and disappear. What remains is an almost empty universe, practically at absolute temperature. And here our journey ends, into the furthest future of the universe, where all that once shone and lived and breathed now lies in perpetual silence. This is the possible end of our universe, a quiet, cold, and dark place, from here, the laws of physics as we know them no longer apply and our understanding is limited. But fear not, for that end is trillions and trillions of years ahead, and who knows what science will discover by then. And this is where our cosmic journey today ends. If you like this video, give it a like and share it with your friends. Subscribe to the channel for more explorations of the universe. To the next.